Hello and welcome to Galaxy Advisors. The purpose of this video is to explain how to install Navicat for MySQL on a Mac and I've updated it as of August 15th. To install Navicat, which now offers a 30-day free trial, start your browser and go to this URL, www.navicat.com slash en forward slash download forward slash download dot html. Click on the Navicat for MySQL download button that you'll see at that um, website. Uh, next, click on the location under, you'll see Navicat for MySQL with a Mac icon, and I suggest that you click the free support. Uh, which is highlighted there in the red box. Then complete the registration form, name, etc. Scroll to the bottom and if you don't want to register you can just click submit or no thanks and uh, just proceed to download. Uh, then uh, click on the download link. You'll give uh, usually a couple um, options for your uh, download location and in case for example my Chrome browser I get a warning do you sure you want to keep this and just say um, click keep uh, then step 9 uh, go to your downloads folder after it's downloaded and double click on the DMG file to start the installation and you'll see something like navicat 101 underscore mysql underscore en dot DMG uh, step 10 is just at the um, agreement a software license agreement click agree in the lower right corner uh, next you'll get a um, a page and what you want to do is to click the Navicat for MySQL app and drag that to the right into that applications folder uh, after you do that you'll see a little message come on about being copied and then after the file has been copied just close this window by clicking the uh, red little dot in the upper um, left corner and now MySQL for Navicat on a Mac has been installed. So next uh, you want to start it and first you have to make sure that your MySQL server started and if it's not configured to start automatically when your computer starts recall the steps that click the black apple in the upper left corner click um, system preferences at the little um, drop down box then click the MySQL icon uh, click the OK at the message that you'll get um, then you'll get another window and you want to click start MySQL server uh, then um, if you, you'll be prompted to enter your computer password here again kind of the max security and click um, enter your password for your computer here and click OK then MySQL is running a little message will come back and you'll see it in green it says my SQL server instance is running so you know MySQL is um, um, just fine uh, then uh, we're all set to start Navicat in the Applications folder. Double click Navicat for MySQL app. Uh, window will open again, double checking you're sure you want to um, open this and click open. And then click the trial version here at the next window. And then click on the local host to see the databases. And when you do that, it's going to prompt you for your MySQL password. Again, that's your MySQL password. And if you didn't create one, just click Enter or click OK. And then you'll see the databases that are available. So the, the next time, um, it's pretty easy. Just start MySQL server if you need it. Again, some people set their MySQL to automatically start when their computer starts. Then in the Applications folder, just double-click Navicat for MySQL app to start it. Enter your MySQL server password if you created one. Otherwise, just hit Return or click OK, and Navicat will be up and going. Um, here is the um, URL for to officially register and buy a copy. Um, again, it's a 30 day free trial um, available now and if you are a student or a member at an educational institution you will qualify for the non-commercial um, price there so with that that should um, complete your um, all your condor installation steps including the highly recommended optional navicat and you're ready to uh, use condor best wishes